Hello and namaste all the pharma professionals. Welcome back to yet another learning video. In this video we are going to learn about different stability climatic zones of the world as per ICH, various countries and their respective stability climatic zones and finally we will learn a shortcut trick to remember stability climatic zones of the various countries. So let's get started without any further delay. As for ICH, the world has been divided into four main stability climatic zones. Those are Zone 1, Zone 2, Zone 3, Zone 4. As you can see on the screen that Zone 4 is further divided into two sub-zones. Those are 4A, 4B. Zone 1 is called as Temperate Zone. Zone 2 is called as Mediterranean Zone or Subtropical Zone. Zone 3 is called as Hot and Dry Zone. Zone 4A is called as hot and humid zone. Zone 4B is called as hot and high humid zone. Now we will see what are the temperature and humidity conditions of these zones. For zone 1, temperature will be 21 degrees Celsius and humidity will be 45%. For zone 2, temperature will be 25 degrees Celsius and humidity will be 60%. For zone 3, temperature will be 30 degrees Celsius and humidity will be very less, that is 35%. For zone 4A, temperature will be 30 degrees Celsius and humidity will be 65%. For last zone 4B, temperature will be 30 degrees Celsius and humidity will be very high, that is approximately 75%. So now I will tell you a shortcut how to remember all these stability climatic zones. So friends, what you have to do, uh, you have to remember only first zone, that is temperate zone. Zone 1 is called as temperate zone and when you will speak temperate, so initial three words you consider, T-E-M. From T-E-M you will remember temperate and from M you can remember Mediterranean zone, which is nothing but our second zone. And for third zone, you can call it as HD zone. For 4A zone, you can call it as double H. And for 4, 4B, you can call as triple H. So HD, double H, triple H. These are for 3, 4A and 4B zone shortcuts. You have to simply remember temperate zone. So by remembering simply a temperate zone, you can decode your initial two zones. Those are temperate, M for Mediterranean. HD, double H, triple H. HD means hot and dry zone, which is zone 3. Double H means hot and humid, which is 4A. And triple H is nothing but our hot and high humid, which is fourth zone. So this is the shortcut to remember all the stability climatic zones in a shortcut tree. So friends, now we will learn various countries of the world and their climatic zone. As you can see on the screen, a colored map of the world. In that one, there are four different colors, blue, yellow, light yellow and the red. So the countries which are coming under your zone one, they has been given the blue color. And most of the countries of your Europe, Canada, Russia, UK, they all are coming in your zone one. Okay, now comes the zone two. In zone 2, the color is given yellow and the countries which will come in the zone 2, those are USA, China, Japan, Australia, South Africa, Israel, Iran, North Korea, South Korea, etc. So now comes your zone number 3 and for zone number 3, you can see this color. These few countries, they will come in the zone 3 and the countries name are Iraq, Jordan, Chad. Botswana, etc. Now comes the last zone of the world, which is zone 4. In zone 4, our most beautiful country of the world, India, will come along with India, its neighbor countries like uh, Sri Lanka, Pakistan, Indonesia, and uh, Bangladesh, UAE, Oman. They all will come in the zone 4. So friends, now I will tell you a trick how you people can remember some of the countries and their climatic zones. First, we will start with the USA. I hope you people know that some of the countries like Japan, Australia, Israel, South Korea, they are the best friend countries of USA. 
and if you know the best friend countries of usa then you people will also be aware of the enemies of the usa those are china north korea and iran so whatever country which is friend and enemy of usa they are also having the same climatic zone now comes the another trick i hope you people know that after india in which country highest number of sikh community people will be found and the answer will be canada so what i can say that for sikh community people canada is the number one country where they will prefer to live after india so canada will be having the zone one because it's a number one country for the sikh community people after india and now i hope you people also know this thing that with respect to area which one is the largest country of the world the answer will be russia so russia is the number one country with respect to the area so that's why its stability climatic zone will be also one now you can remember uh, one thing that uh, india is coming under your zone 4 and uh, india's uh, good friend is brazil so brazil and india they are sharing their climatic zone as well as one more thing you can remember that friends in zone 3 as i have told you that very less number of countries are coming so only one or two countries name you can remember which not a, which is not a big deal for you people to remember and zone 3 countries are our iraq and jordan so friends i hope that you people got clarity over these tricks how to remember climatic zones along with the country names and these tricks will be very helpful for you people whenever you people want to recall these climatic zones so with this i would like to wrap up my video thank you so much for watching the video